Bonnie and Atiina arrive at the Codesmith's workshop, a magical place where JavaScript is forged. The wise Codesmith, Byte, welcomes them and reveals that today they won't be working on their website. Instead, they need to gather the right tools before they can begin their JavaScript adventure. Whoa, this place is amazing. Is this where we're going to write JavaScript? That's right. But before we can start casting JavaScript spells, we need the right tools. Today, we're going on a tool gathering quest. Oh, a quest. I love quests. Do we need a sword? A shield? Maybe a pet dragon? Haha, <laughs> not exactly. But we do need to install a few magical tools to make writing JavaScript smooth and fun. First, we need Node.js. It's like a special engine that helps JavaScript run outside a browser. It also comes with NPM, a package manager that helps us install extra tools when needed. So, it's like a backpack full of useful gadgets? Exactly. Here's how to install it. 1. Go to nodejs.org. 2. Download the LTS, long-term support, version, it's the best for beginners. 3. Follow the installation steps and complete the setup. Now that we have Node.js, let's make coding even easier. Do you remember in Episode 1, Hello Codetopia, we learned how to install extensions in VS Code? Oh yeah, we installed cool tools to help us write code. That's right. Today, we need to install CodeRunner.run extension. This lets us run JavaScript quickly inside VS Code. Nice. No need to open a browser. That's true. But did you know we can also use a browser? Sometimes, we'll write JavaScript and run it right inside the browser console. Next time, I'll show you how we use both VS Code and the browser to run JavaScript and see what happens. Whoa, so we have two different ways to run JavaScript. That's so cool. Exactly. We'll use both to see JavaScript in action. Now that our toolbox is ready, we're almost set to start our JavaScript adventure. Next time, we'll learn some magic words like variables, storing information like a treasure chest, data types, different kinds of information like numbers, words, and true-false statements. Comments, leaving notes in our code, just like in HTML and CSS. Console.log, a secret JavaScript spell that helps us test our code. I can't wait. Let's get coding. Activity time. 1. Install node.js from nodejs.org. 2. Add the code runner extension on VS Code. Congratulations, young coders. You've gathered your JavaScript tools. Next time, we'll write our first JavaScript code and bring magic to the screen. Like, comment, share, and subscribe.